it just doesn't make any sense to me to leave them sitting there like sitting ducks waiting for this virus to take over. Donnie Marana is sounding the alarm tonight after she was told her mother, who is living in a senior's lodge, won't be eligible for the COVID-19 vaccine until April. Marana worries it might be too late. She does have COPD and lung issues, so I just feel like... Um, she is extremely vulnerable when it comes to COVID. Marana's 74-year-old mother is currently living at Kiwanis Place, a downtown senior's housing lodge. The facility was recently home to a major COVID outbreak. Last week, City News was the first to report the outbreak, which grew to 189 cases. It was the largest outbreak of active cases in Edmonton at the time. Marana was unaware of the high case count until our story aired. Kiwanis Place is a lodge. It's not deemed a long-term care home or an assisted living facility. That means residents living here will not be vaccinated during the first phase of the COVID-19 vaccines, even though some seniors are high risk and access support and care through Alberta Health Services. According to the province's vaccine distribution list, residents who are 75 and up are the next priority group slated for some time next month. Marana doesn't agree with that timeline. It makes no sense to me. It's the same it's the same group of vulnerable seniors in one building to the next whether it be long-term care whether it be assisted living or whether it be a lodge currently the vaccine has only been offered to health care workers paramedics and those working and living in long-term care facilities in a statement to city news a spokesperson for ahs writes we would love to be able to vaccinate all seniors including those under 75 but the reality is that we have a severely limited vaccine supply and an evidence-based order of priority so it's going to take some time. Alberta's health minister, Tyler Shandro, spoke about the vaccine's delay in a press conference Friday. Pfizer has indicated to the federal government that there will be a temporary delay in vaccine shipments due to expansion plans at their European facility. The number of doses will be fewer, we are advised. City News was also contacted by another family member of a resident living at Kiwanis Place who claims she was also left in the dark over the outbreak. She says the meal service at the facility has not been up to par. You know, they're not getting their meals on time now. They're not. They're, they got a bologna sandwich one night. A bologna sandwich. Okay, they're 75, 76, 80 years old, these people. That's not enough. We reached out to Kiwanis Place with these concerns. In a statement, they tell us their menus are created on a four-week rotation and are developed by their Red Seal chefs and approved by a registered dietitian. In Edmonton, Rochelle Sufi, City News.